The following video is brought to you by Armis, where wisdom always wins. Hello, I'm Sonia from India, a member of Armis, where wisdom always wins. I'm taking some classes from FCAT 2.0 for math subject. Please have a look on it. Question 1. Calvin made a pictograph to show the number of students in his class who drink milk at lunch. This is the pictograph. Students drinking milk at lunch. Monday, 3 cartons. On Tuesday, 3.5 cartons drink by the students. Wednesday, 5 milk cartons drink by the students. On Thursday, 4.5 cartons milk drink by the students. On Friday, six and a half cartons drink milk by the students. If the pictograph shows that six students drink milk at lunch on Monday and ten students drink milk at lunch on Wednesday, how many students drink milk at lunch on Friday? Four options are there. A. Six. B. Seven. C. 12 D 13 As the pictogram shows six students drinks milk at lunch on Monday on Monday six students drink milk so six students drink milk on Monday as per the pictograph on Monday three cartoons are shown it means six students drink three cartoons three cartoons Three cartoons. So one cartoon is equals to six by three. By divide six to three, there is two students. One cartoon represents two students. Now on Wednesday. 10 students drink 5 cartons. 10 students drink 5 cartons. So 1 carton is equals to 10 by 5 which is equals to 2 students. So for these two cases one cartoon is equals to two students it means every each one cartoon represents two students one cartoon represents two students so half cartoon represent one student now we have to find how many students drink milk on friday on friday there are six and a half blocks are there one block represents six students so this first we calculate for the six students for six cartoons. So six cartoons represents six into two that is twelve students and remaining half cartoon is equals to one student as we, as we described earlier so total number of students is 12 plus 1 13 so the answer is D 13 students drink milk on Friday
क्वेश्चन टू इजाबेला कैन नॉट रिमेंबर द प्रोडक्ट ऑफ नाइन क्रॉस एट विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग इज अनदर एक्सप्रेशन डैट इजाबेला कुड यूज टू फाइंड द प्रोडक्ट ऑफ नाइन क्रॉस एट फोर ऑप्शन फर्स्ट ऑप्शन इज एफ नाइन क्रॉस फाइव प्लस नाइन क्रॉस थ्री सेकेंड ऑप्शन जी नाइन क्रॉस फोर प्लस नाइन क्रॉस टू थर्ड ऑप्शन एच नाइन क्रॉस वन प्लस फोर क्रॉस टू द लास्ट ऑप्शन इज आई नाइन क्रॉस टू प्लस एट क्रॉस सिक्स एज पर द क्वेश्चन ईसा बेला नॉट एबल टू रिमेंबर द प्रोडक्ट ऑफ नाइन क्रॉस एट टू सिंप्लीफाई दिस क्वेश्चन वी है टू सिंप्लीफाई दिस क्वेश्चन वी डिवाइड दिस एट इंटू टू पार्ट वी डिवाइड एट इंटू फाइव प्लस थ्री डिवाइड एट into two parts that is 5 plus 3 so the answer is 9 cross 5 plus 3 we can write it like this 8 in the terms of 5 and 3 now open the braces 9 cross 5 plus 9 cross 3 9 cross 5 is 45 plus 9 cross 3 is 27 the sum of 45 plus 27 is 72 which is equal to the sum of 'cause equal to the multiply of 9 cross 8 So the correct answer is F. Hmm. Question three: The drawing below shows an open scallop shell. This is the drawing. How many lines of symmetry does the drawing have? Four options are there. Three. Two, one, and zero. Now for the solution, let's see. This is a figure. This is the center of the figure. From this center, two lines are goes over there, and two lines symmetrically two lines are goes in this direction. So, if we curve, if we flip the paper between its center. then this part is exactly equal to this part if we flip the card flip the figure from the vertical side it means this is the line of symmetry for this figure now if we do same thing in the horizontal direction then let's see what happens if we did same thing in the horizontal direction then this is the figure and the next part is exactly the same as of the previous one it means this line also shows the symmetry this line is the symmetry and this line is the symmetry so there are two symmetries for this figure so our answer is option b that is 2 question 4 dorian is making a border for his bedroom wall using the pattern below in this pattern the first shape is triangle then square inverse of the triangle circle this is the first pattern now the second one is again triangle square inverse of triangle circle then she repeats it again triangle square inverse of triangle 
circle now again triangle square now what is the next figure in his pattern this is the question we have four options option a triangle option b square option c inverse of triangle and option d circle as we see in our question that the pattern is repeated like in the first thing in a pattern in a first block triangle square inverse of triangle circle again the whole series is repeated triangle square inverse of triangle square and circle again the pattern is repeated triangle square inverse of triangle circle and because the all patterns are repeated so here the pattern is again repeated so the first is triangle square and from in the last one there is a inverse of the triangle so the answer is inverse of the triangle option c correct answer is c triangle square and the answer is inverse of the triangle question 5 leah visited a horse ranch she noticed that 6 by 8 of the horses were spotted as shown below these are the six horses out of eight. which eight horses out of which <laughs> only two horses are not spotted except that all horses has a spot on his body which fraction is equivalent to 6 by 8 a 1 by 2 b 1 by 4 d 2 by 3 c 2 by 3 and d 3 by 4 to calculate the fraction of 6 by 8 we convert it into a factor 6 has a factor of factor of 6 2 cross 3 factor of 8 2 cross 4 so we write 6 by 8 in the terms of its factors which is equals to 2 by 3 divided by 2 by 4 2 to went to a cancel out so the remaining is 3 by 4 we have four options 1 by 2 1 by 4 2 by 3 and 3 by 4 so the correct answer is 3 by 4 that is d so correct option is d question 6 a group of four friends will share 32 pieces of candy equally which expression can be used to find how many pieces of candy each friend will get four options f 32 4 G, thirty-two minus four, H, thirty-two divided by four, I, thirty-two multiplied by four. Solution for this, as per the question, four friends have thirty-two. and this which is equally distributed it means each friend has equal number all four friends have equal number of candies so four friends have 32 candies so one friend have 32 divided by 4 candies so 32 divided by 4 and the options are 32 plus 4 no 32 minus 4 no 32 divided by 4 yeah this is the correct answer so the correct answer is 8th option h 32 divided by 4 question 7 two flowers are pictured below on flower a this is the flower a 1 by 2 
of the petals are shaded half petals are shaded on flower b this is a flower b 2 by 5 of the petals are shaded which inequality below correctly compares the fraction of petals that are shaded four options a 1 by 2 is greater than 2 by 5 b 1 by 2 is less than 2 by 5 c 2 by 1 is greater than 5 by 2 and d 2 by 1 is less than 5 by 2